I'm so excited to show you this project. I used the Dollar Tree Hummingbird Feeder unusually and turned it into a bird bath for hummingbirds. I'm hoping to attract them to my garden. I thought using a hummingbird feeder can help to get discovered since they may recognize this feeder. I have several bird baths I made in the past but none of them seems to be attracting hummingbirds. And I love to have some of those beautiful birds here. I gathered my materials. Some I picked up from Dollar Tree and some I already have. This is an old plastic plate unfortunately it has a crack here but i can easily mend it with my soldering iron there it's already fixed this is from a dollar store i paid dollar 25 cents it's a hummingbird feeder but in this project i'm going to use it upside down and turn these feeder holes into shower heads i'm also using this plastic cup and plate to add some fun dimensions to our bath the first step is to open up all the holes for the fountain. This small plate will be the top tier of our bath. These are the nozzles that came with the fountain. I need this piece. It will go through like this. I had to adjust the thickness a bit with my soldering iron. I will be connecting my fountain hose to it shortly. But first I want to make some perches. I picked up a twig or you can even use a chopstick if you like. I'm going to go with the twig for a natural look. Some more holes to open. Since hummingbirds are attracted to red and bright colors, I'm using lots of red items to become hummingbirds' favorite spot for taking a nice bath. Getting the hummingbirds here will take some time and patience, but in the meantime, I'll be adding some feeders around the area as well. I just haven't gotten to that yet. I use the hot glue to attach some of the parts. Please don't forget to like and share this video, that helps my channel a lot. This is a basic solar powered fountain from Amazon. I think I paid around $15. The hose goes through the lower tier and gets attached to the nozzle. But when I was running the hose through, I ran into a little problem. This branch was on the way, so I had to cut the middle of it. It was an easy fix, no big deal. I'm using a cookie container as a bucket for water and I will place the bucket into this planter pot to hide the ugly look. One last hole for drainage, I forgot to do that earlier. These are again from a dollar store. I picked the red ones for hummingbirds. I finished decorating it with some pebbles and shells and some fake greens. Here we go. All I need is now some hummingbirds. Hope they come soon. Thank you for visiting and don't forget to watch my other bird bath videos from these links.